In the previous lecture, we have seen what is bootstrap and how to use it. In this lecture, we'll see crispy forms. What is crispy forms and how to implement it in our template. Welcome. So we have uh, seen our first little bootstrap and uh, so now in uh, this session we'll see uh, some different kind of stuff see uh, means I'll make you clear about it and just uh, go to the list okay so for that first uh, I want to show you some third party app uh, which is called uh, crispy forms uh, this is any I mean, third party app which is uh, called as crispy forms uh, it is really very useful to make your forms effective and uh, some user friendly and attractive so you can go through the website and uh, you need to install it first by this crispy forms and uh, and then you have to define in your installed apps just like here crispy forms so it's a bootstrap uh, means it is a bootstrap functionality means bootstrap version which is used by so many developers and etc etc if you want to use your crispy forms in your forms that means in your html you need to just load this just like this load crispy forms tags and you can use it we'll see how to use it and uh, first of all we need to install it so just copy and uh, paste in your terminal just uh, paste forms so we need to install it first by the command as i've already installed it is saying that requirement already up to date fine so now we'll see how to use it and we need to specify in our installed app so just i'm going to the user py and uh, so we specified it and uh, save it and I want to just refresh and yeah here it is we are form uh, just when we include uh, there is higher version of crispy forms uh, but uh, here we'll see some basics of the crispy forms uh, you can go through the website of uh, Django crispy forms and you can uh, go through the link so we need to specify over here and instead of this we should define just like form pipe crispy so this is how we can define it just uh, go through the and refresh it so uh, this is just basic uh, it shows us the required field for the star and uh, it will little bit like uh, you can say that uh, means provide some efficient user interface uh, will see register and login with the crispy forms and it will it means it will look very effy means uh, attractive and uh, something like that so we'll see how to do that and uh, but as of now we'll keep it as simple as that and uh, now if we want this to the in the center uh, we can go to the uh, means uh, you can say that bootstrap bootstrap we can go to the bootstrap and uh, the version uh, which I'm using which I'm using is 3.3.7 and uh, CSS and I'll go to the grid system so what is the grid system is uh, it allows us to create uh, means invisible table in the div so that we can uh, specify the position of our forms so let's go to the yes uh, we can uh, say that what is this column sm in small and phi phi is the you can say that the fifth number of columns so just one two three four and five md means middle and sm is small so whenever you want so yes xs xs and md so you can go through the stuff and uh, you can see the whole details of it but as of now we'll use sm so uh, okay fine you can go through this and uh, there is one more which is called offset uh, i want to show you this as well so offset is basically provides us the 
एडिशनल फंक्शनलिटीज जस्ट लाइक ऑफसेटिंग कॉलम्स दिस इज वॉट कॉल्ड ऑफसेट वेन यू प्रोवाइड द ऑफसेट इट विल गो टू द अपोजिट साइड जस्ट लाइक दिस वेन एवर यू सी द ऑफसेट जस्ट लाइक लेट मी कॉपी दिस एंड जस्ट दिव क्लास एंड पेस्ट सो लेट मी क्लोज द डेव let me see what happened over there okay fine so this is what basically an offset if i change uh, if i change to 6 and uh, refresh it is not going to change but if i going to change here yes it is going to change uh just uh, it, it's a standard practice if, uh, you want to play around it you can play around it around it you can uh, specify your position of the offset uh, and uh, okay fine you can play around it as uh, like this and fine so this is how we can define the we can give the uh, means position of our div and if you md then uh, okay it uh, doesn't make any difference because of the offset okay fine not an issue you can go through this by your own and uh, you can create your uh, own offset and uh, sorry you can define your div position so fine so this is basically just a overview of crispy forms and uh, just like uh, div position by defining the class in it fair enough fine If you have any doubt, just let us know. Otherwise, keep going. In this lecture, we have seen crispy forms, and we have implemented it in our template.